waiting for Cornelia. She should be here on the next train. I got on a train beforehand. But uh, yeah, she should be here and we are going to head either coffee or a, a smoothie, one or the other. But yeah, I'm looking forward to getting a drink and then heading to find a good spot. Today's gonna be great. Hello. You good? We're now here in Pret. Um, Cornelia's just finishing the verification. I'm doing well. Um, nice coffee, I'm gonna wake myself up and we're gonna get cracking in just a sec. I forgot my ND, so it's gonna be not as blurry as usual, but we'll do. Just finished my coffee. We are heading to scooters. I can see them right in front of me. Um, just here. Cornelia's gonna test them first and we'll, I'll test them after it's when we get to a, a good location. Okay. Now we got this. So this is the lime scooter. It's pretty heavy, it's bulky. It's got okay speed, but like for an everyday person who doesn't know how to ride, it worked, yeah? How was your experience I think as a was, first time? It was great. It was definitely easier to use than I thought it was gonna be. Um, you had a terrible first experience. Yeah, because the ones in Poland were just, I think these are like more advanced because I use lime as well. Um, but yeah, I think this would be better if they were faster, but I do understand why they can't make them faster. It's because of safety and the general public safety. Um, that being said, I think it's worth it. Would you go on it again? Definitely. Yeah. And, and it's great. As much as it, it is slow, I would definitely go on it again. Not only is it like fun, yeah. not only is it fun, but it's also like, such a good way to commute because uh, public transport can be expensive in London. I'm not saying this is totally cheap. I think it could be a little bit cheaper, um, but I think it's it's better for the environment and it's better for commuting in general because it's faster. And yeah, I would recommend it completely. Yeah, so there you have it. Cornelia's approval on uh, whether you should ride it. It's literally a scooter that gets you from A to B. I liked it and would totally use it. If I don't have my skateboard around, I would definitely ride it. Um, no harm, no foul. So this is the start line. It's very faint, it's here. And um, we have to force it up. Three, two, one, go. That's right. Yeah, I'm a clear winner. I've just gone. So that was only 18 miles an hour, which is actually much faster than the other ones, uh, which is the scooter, it only does 12 and a half miles an hour. At the moment I prefer the scooter, because it's easier to use. And that's coming from someone that uh, skateboards all the time. Yeah, you have a skateboard, penny board, so yeah, that's fascinating. I think, I think it's because this is a long board, plus like the acceleration is so tricky. It, like, it you need to lean into it yeah. and then it carries you away. Once you get that out of the way, um, then it's great.
it blocks it. Yeah, there's a blocker at the bottom there. Oh wow. Which I guess it's Wait, this way. Oh, it does block it as well. I mean, so you it's don't not fall off. Bad. Yeah, true. Like but like at the same time as like you almost hit the car trying yeah. to do a Just turn. Just a simple turn. Okay, let's go. let's go. This is actually super fun. Oh, yeah. One feature I wish it did have yeah. is like a pause that actually worked. So what do you mean pause? So that like you know like what we're doing right now. We're not actually using it. Yeah. We're just standing there. So I kind of just wish it Can you not pause it in the app? Can you? Oh yeah, pause. Do you think it's gonna Try it? You need to make a quick stop, please. Pause and save your movie for. Oh, so it's the same thing as if Ending you, it. Yeah. I mean as in uh, no no. It's the same as if you were using it. Because it's still gonna charge you if you pause it. Which is kind of pointless in my opinion. Okay. So it's not like actual like Yeah. I wish you could just like literally just pause it and it cancels charging you for a little bit. Yeah, that is pretty mm. It's not it's not ideal. Mm -hmm. There we go, this is better. Oh sun. Yeah, straight into the sun. Oh, no. As well as the QR code. Trigger on the right. Front brake. Back brake. Bell. Motion or the suspension? Is it in 60? I mean Yeah, it's in Screaming at him, I saw it from a distance. And I ran to quickly grab it. It was like it was literally this close to hitting the What has just happened? Oh my god, so someone this mini cooper behind me had almost reversed into the camera, which is on a time lapse. Also the skateboard was there. To be fair it was black, but just, how did you miss that? <laughs> and Courtney and I was screaming like no 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 stop 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 and he wasn't stopping and I literally had to move in front of the car to, to for him to not literally destroy your escape and the camera I was here anyway <laughs> let's go to a better location Instagram story Cruising through the streets of London. It is going well. We're going left up here. Yeah. Ready. So we've just entered this zone here. This is probably Westminster. And it's now stopped us from going any further. Or Cornelia. Yeah, that's now out of the borough. So we need to cross here and head to uh, back into Kensington. Did you see that dog? Oh my god, I just saw it. That was a dog and the guy yeah. sitting, the dog was in the front seat. I saw that. Okay, so safely cross over to the left here. Okay, we need to find another spot where we can chill. Some, somewhere better. Are we pausing or are we cruising? Hey Siri. Yeah. Here she is. She didn't leave me. She waited for me. Yeah, I, I was very confused in that junction. That junction was horrible. I'm still faster. So they were coming here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Over there. Oh, okay. It's right behind you. Nice. I know it's a bit of a thing. I love it. I mean, yeah. 
Okay, how? Take a photo of it. Oh. Nice, good. And we're done. Cost us 13 pounds to ride around for an hour. Are you guys done with this one? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, thanks yeah. very much. So, uh, scanning, doing the bike. You can compare how it is, both of them. Oh, retractable. Yeah. <laughs> you ready? Keep up here. She is smoking me. How, how is this possible? The bike is nice and easy. So we're going to go straight down here on a yeah, the main road. This is a good day. Red light, red light, red, red light. Unable to win. That's fine. We don't need this. So, feelings and the thoughts about the scooter. The Lime scooter is a excellent piece of transport. It is slightly slow due to the 12, mile, 12 and a half mile limit. Is it dirty? Just, we've just arrived here at Charing Cross Station. Um, ride was amazing. Cornelius got also feedback, but um, still getting directions. Um, we're going to head to a parking location, just around the corner from here, and there's an ambulance. We just arrived at the docking station, a uh, little, just a little walk further. Cornelia is plugging it in now. Plugged in? Good. It's loading, taking a picture. From the top. The Lime Scooter is overall a great piece of transport. It is pretty good. But there are like the bike, scooter, bike was much better. The line bike, much faster. The scooter was good. It was only reaching 12 and a half or 13 miles an hour, which is fast enough, but it wasn't like good enough. Yeah, it would be much better if it was faster. Uh, I guess one of my concerns as I was the one driving it on the streets the most, um, is the indicators, well, the lack of it. Yeah. Um, so, I'm literally just going to repeat the same thing. Yeah. So I'll see what uh, So how the throttle... Fro throttle. Again. How the throttle... Fuck. How the... Keep going, keep going. Oh no! Okay. Go on. Um, I can't focus now. How, what does the throttle do? Indicate. The throttle, no one is wrong. How you... So, so how the throttle on the lime scooter is on the right hand side, so you can't really indicate on the when you're turning right because there's literally no way of doing it without slowing down and just possibly crashing into something. So if that issue could be fixed either by like I don't know, adding some indicators onto the handles or or just making the throttle on both sides so that you need to go that that would yeah that is literally a very sticky topic because if you add throttle on both sides then it's like yeah. yeah if you add throttle on the right and it, and it keeps, keeps going then throttle on the right and it keeps going of like two seconds after it's dangerous yeah um i think the best option would be if like off the handles they added like these little indicators and some mirrors as well like on the screen the mirrors the, the, what's it called um uh, yeah, motorcycle mirrors. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what else did we talk about? 
bit of learning and it helps you learn how to drive because I went on the roundabout and the roundabout was nice but I had no clue how to commute yeah like and also attack the roundabout who has way how to this that so it really helped teach how to do the roundabout yeah so for like young drivers like us that are still in the learning process of all the like how to actually commute around the city and around the streets safely this is a great learning tool i guess um because and it's, it's good practice exactly exactly because it's, it's really safe in a way i mean obviously you can still crash and and it can be harmful but it's much safer than for example driving in a car which then results in a in a worse crash and then paying a lot of money which is yeah. Because it makes you focus but then like you could ride a bike but then you're focused on other things with that view it's like a I think car yeah, it's different because it's motorized and motorized vehicles just feel different like, they just go and you actually have to focus because yeah. you're going much faster than you would yeah. with the bike you're pedaling and you're just going but with the motor you don't you get to think yeah. like in a car so yeah and it's the same for the lime bicycles because um, they are are they yeah, they're assisted. Yeah, assisted, they're assisted, assisted motorized, motorized bicycles. I don't yeah. know how to say it. Um, so they do kind of feel more like a motorcycle, but like a cheaper, more accessible version of one. Mm. Um, so it's also really fun because you can reach. I don't know what the speed could be. You were going 20 miles an hour. Yeah, so it's an average like London speed, uh, like a 20. road miles an hour. Yeah. So so it's really cool to to I guess commute around London in that way. Like and you get to experience it. You're keeping it with transport, exactly. which is key. Mm -hmm. With the scooters, you were below. Everyone yeah. was just trying, like, holding, mm -hmm. waiting behind you. At least with the bikes, you were going, and mm -hmm. they could. everyone could just ride normally. Exactly. Would you ride on it again? Definitely. The scooter? Uh, the scooter, if, if I wanted to enjoy, like, my evening with my friends or something, then sure. Uh, but then you commuting, could just, not so much. You could ride the bike. So, bike? Yeah. Bike would be for commuting. Definitely. Because if you can ride the scooter, you might just ride the bike. Because the bike, it's faster. Yeah, and it's cheaper by 1p. It's cheaper by 1p. And that 1p does add up. It does. After you're riding for like an hour. Yeah, it really does. Okay, would I use it if I had no other choice? Because I don't want to be sweaty if I use a scooter or bike. That's you're the problem. Not really sweaty though. I will definitely give it a try, the bike. But the scooter, I would use it like for a quick journey but they're not available in Westminster so at the moment yeah that's where we're at anyway heading home thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one peace good to get the peace and the hand and we have arrived here at Trafalgar Square thank you what a wonderful day it has been we've done so many good activities we went to Charing Cross and then we went to Huh? Covent Garden, yep. Said hello to a good friend of ours, Alexa. And now we are sat here. I just had some food. I was hungry. We had a drink. Hot day. Nice to relax. This camera is very heavy. Oh. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy the rest of today. We're going to get a time lapse. And that was uh, so far today. I'm also keeping up with the Apple News.